Hi guys, welcome to this short video about what you can do if you are stuck in the alt top function which is actually just showing the open windows or the open programs and you can't do anything, you can't quit. So this is how it looks when we hit alt tab in windows, doesn't matter what kind of windows it is, I think it's available since probably Windows 3.1, something like that. So I hit it for you. And so here we have the thing where you can see all open programs. And even if there's something from the system, uh, you could see that. So usually what we can do, we have a couple of different options. When we keep holding the Alt and we hit a couple of times the tab, we can switch through these things. And when we release the buttons, then it will open the one which has the blue border. We can also close uh, such programs here with the X and uh, usually this works pretty good. I have been using this since years and uh, I never had a problem uh, till this morning on Windows 11 and I opened that and it wouldn't move away and the big problem was I couldn't reach all the other things here in the back. So there was just this thing here, this area here in front and I even couldn't do something. I couldn't hit like the X or so, couldn't change, couldn't switch. It was stuck. This thing was totally stuck and it was in the front so I couldn't reach anything here in the back anymore, couldn't do anything. I mean, I could still open the task manager with control alt delete or with control shift escape whatsoever. I could open that, but I couldn't reach it anymore. I couldn't do anything. And I had something in the back, which I uh, had to finish before shutting down. I mean, of course you could just hit the on off switch on your PC and then it's shutting down. But of course you cannot save anything anymore. If you have like an open windows with Word or Excel, something like that, and you want to save it, if you don't have activated the automatic save and the project or the work is still open, what to do? And this is the thing which helped. I hit the window key. So unfortunately, of course, I have to release the keys now and it will go away. So it's not the same thing as you have seen before. But what I did still while the thing was uh, like almost blocking the whole thing, I could hit the windows key and then type CMD, which was actually in the back. I mean, I could just see this part here underneath. I couldn't see the top here, but I knew it was a CMD. So it has some kind of a focus here. And when I hit the enter it would open the command prompt exactly like that and the idea from my side was actually that i would use some command here uh, to terminate like the explorer or something which would then uh, release this blockage but it was not needed because uh, exactly at the moment when this command prompt opened it was removing this blockage in the front and everything was back to normal. So if you are in the same situation, you have to finish something, you don't just want to shut down the PC without saving your work, this could be a solution for you if you are in the same situation. So for me it worked and I hope it will work for you too. So if you have been in the same situation, it would be really interesting to learn from you if it helped uh, to you. Just let us know down in the feedback area. I'm always happy to talk about these things. And so if you like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching. See you next time.